what's going on guys so um while i was playing the game i thought i'd make a quick little video on all the events that came out with the update i know i'm a little late i apologize but i wanted to make a video because these events are ending on the 12th which i find a little odd because this update literally came out a couple days ago so uh by the time you see this video it'll either be saturday or sunday so about a you know give or take about five days since it came out right i think it's a little weird but i mean sure right sure um so you can see right here that all these events will end on the 12th now looking at the calendar from when i'm recording this that is four days away literally that is four days away right so by the time you guys see this it'll probably be like give or take three or two days away from when it ends and i think that's a little strange because typically they go away once a new celebration starts but in this case it's gonna end a little earlier unless gother does come out when these events end that if that's the case I, i'm not too sure uh, someone let me know down in the comments if you know um but yeah if that's the case then that makes sense but finishing all these events by the 12 like okay so for starters let's look at the special missions even i haven't finished it i just haven't really had the urge or the you know motivation to play this game like that so let's go ahead and let's look at the missions uh two i already completed two out of the five or uh, five missions so all you got to do is summon heroes two times blah, 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 blah. get a bingo 10 times that's easy then you have to clear the final episode of the world quest which is born as hell but if you can finish it sure uh clear the uh the special disaster battle three times very very easy stuff and then exchange shot or uh, use the exchange shop five times during the event period so not hard missions whatsoever um but like i said I, I haven't really had the urge or motivation to play this game like that right so um it is what it is also this is very good for multiple reasons because this will give you a free dupe a free dupe of easton it won't give you easton but it'll give you a free dupe of easton if you can manage to pull her honestly skip the banner uh, that should like I sh there's no reason to even like make a video on that skip the banner there's no reason to even um summon on that banner but uh the world quest obviously is also going to end i believe on the 12th i'm not too too sure about that myself but i believe it ends on the 12th of um of october so next week it'll probably end so we want to make sure to get that done as well uh let's see what else we got here special disaster battle also ends on the 12th so i, I guess they really really want you to grind out this shop the shop isn't bad i mean the, the cards they give you guaranteed easton right which i mean her stats are okay, okay you know a little a fair bit of hp you get this as well you get a armano who has okay i guess you know whatever it's not really that important and then you also get a guaranteed i believe camilla and she has pretty you know overall decent stats as well so nothing too crazy in terms of that get a new outfit for easton honestly i don't really care too much about doing all this um i got all the costumes in terms of the you know the uh this has disasters uh you know nothing too too crazy here yeah see growth i mean sure if you want to grind it out um i think they took a really really big l on not giving demon mats demon mats are really really important so i wish that they would have gave them out i mean i'm glad that they you know they're giving out what 10 super waiting coins that is good or, or 15 super waiting coins that is good um also 30 of the uh awakening cosmetics or whatever you want to call them upgrade cosmetics that's good but i do feel like they should have put um demon mats as well in this uh exchange shop so go ahead and get that done again that'll end on the 12th not hard at all not hard at all um you know they're fairly easy i just don't care enough to do it <laughs> i know i'm terrible i know i'm terrible but I, I don't care i think the tower of disaster also yeah this also ends on the 12th again haven't had the strongest urge to play the game so i haven't really done it but i will do it before it leaves because this will give me 10 super wing i need that i need that i'm not gonna i need that <laughs> so it'll give me what uh overall 20 i believe 25 super rating coins oh 30 oh 30 super rating okay that's good 30 super rating coins that, that's good that's good uh bingo event also ends on the 12th as well again everything ended on the 12th i don't know that's weird that is very very strange so all those events that i went over will be ending on the 12th so keep that in mind you want to make sure that you're getting all of this stuff done not hard stuff at all just a little grindy but 
um again not difficult whatsoever uh let's see what else ends on i think that's it in terms of the main important things that end on the 12th the banner itself the banner itself leaves on the 19th i assume that's when we'll get gother i i, I think that's when gother actually drops when when uh when this banner leaves i don't think the events leaving will bring gother at least i'm not too sure about that but i, I think when she leaves gother uh, gother will drop no reason at all to summon on this banner if you guys need you know an explanation as to why i'll tell you why right now easton sucks <laughs> easton sucks i love easton but she is not good she is just she's literally v2 easton of the red one we have so the red easton that we have in game right now right so we go to red units i believe it's over here yeah so th th that's v2 easton like th there's no reason to even summon for her because this easton e is better than the one we had or the one that's uh available to summon for like the uh what is it? awakened easton this Easton is better, like, hands down. Like, this Easton is honestly better because she removes buffs, right? She can increase defense-related stats. She has the same goddamn skill one, so there's no reason to suffer it. Um, her passive, eh, her passive's kind of, eh, it's, 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 man, not that good. But same thing goes for the summonable Easton right now. Her passive is terrible. Like, it, it's, it's honestly bad. Unless you're running a full disaster team, you're not getting anything from her passive. Like you're literally not getting anything from her passive. So, um, not that great. Mono, Mono's pretty good actually. Mono's actually not that bad. She's actually really good. Um, she has, of course, every, every Mono has to, for some reason, have Sever for some strange reason. Uh, <laughs> then she has Spike. I'm not a huge fan, a huge fan of Spike, honestly. Honest to God, I'm not. But you know, it's better than nothing. Uh, I wish this was changed for something else but you know it is what it is her crit chance is good so i don't I, I don't know how often you'll see her crit but um yeah and then her passive her passive also is only for you know the seven catastrophes so you have to have a full seven catastrophes team in order for her passive to proc which and you know, kind of an L, but I, I guess if you really love the seven, you know, the seven catastrophes, there you go. The banner itself isn't that good either. Like I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be straight. It's really not that good. Really, Mono and Valencia are kind of the only reasons you would even summon on this banner. Like honest to God, that's it. Like two units. Like <laughs> the rest are fodder. Like the rest are honestly fodder. Shin's good. Uh, all right, Shin is good. Shin is actually still good. He's just not oh my god broken or needed really except for farming which most people probably already have shin so i don't think it really matters i wish this was a step up banner instead of um a 300 out of 600 because ain't nobody gonna go 600 for these two characters just you shouldn't like you shouldn't if you do you have a problem <laughs> you have a gotcha probably you need to you need to um you need some rehab or something but I mean, yeah, that's it for the video. So all those events will end on the 12th. The banner leaves the 19th. Hopefully you guys did enjoy the video. If you did, leave a like on the video. Also comment below how you're feeling about the events. Uh, did you summon on the banner? You shouldn't, but if you did, um, let me know what you got. And as always, you guys already know, I will see you all next time.